So this is this is brick on the inside. So was he was Carlos saying that it would be stone? But it's interesting, isn't it, that it's brick. So brick, stone, brick. And how the brick, once it's heated like so many times, because this is burnt so many times, it melts and it, it's like it becomes like it's like the soil again. El ladrillo es un material para nosotros muy común porque nuestras tierras son arcillosas, porque se da, se obtiene muy fácilmente en muchas de las regiones de Colombia y estamos familiarizados con él. Fue uno de los materiales más utilizados en la obra de Rogelio, del cual pudo sacar muchas, toda la riqueza, exploró muchas posibilidades y se volvió un material casi plástico. Y una simple pieza de 12 por 6 por 24, que es el ladrillo, se lee de mil maneras diferentes. Lo volvió plástico, lo volvió transparente, lo volvió denso, lo volvió, le, le imprimió un, un lenguaje diferente. How to use brick and instill a kind of character in the architecture. And that's why I think Rogelio Salmona's work is particularly interesting, because he's using brick, but it's, it's the use of brick in a very expressive way. And I think that's the challenge we face for um, the use of brick in a kind of contemporary context, really, is, is how to use it, but how to use it to its full potential, I guess, kind of sculpturally. And I suppose what initially started off as being very practical and continued to be very practical throughout his career, um, actually became much more architectural for him as well. And he kind of, you know, it allowed him, liberated him in a way, um, his skill with brick to move away from a more kind of purist modernism and adopt something that was much more expressive, perhaps more relative to and contextual to, you know, Colombia. Se le formaban cuatro hiladas en seco. Él venía y él los aprobaba si sí se podían empezar a hacer los muros de esa forma o no. Decía, no, cambie esto, vuelve y a veces duraba uno no sé cuánto tiempo esperando que él ordenara hacer ese muro. Eso sí es muy engorroso hacer, sentar esos ladrillitos porque como se da tan poquito mortero en las dos punticas es, es dispendioso y, y por lo que es curvo pues igual. También es, es bien engorroso hacerlo. But the sculpting of space, the way he plays with geometry is, um, I really do think they feel his architecture feels geological and like extrusions of the earth. You know, something that has come up and erupted 